The year was 1666, late one September night. The baker's shop in Pudding Lane glowed with an orange light. The baker's oven was on fire. The flames began to spread. Thomas the baker was upstairs. He was asleep in bed. Before too long, the walls caught fire. There billowed out black smoke. The fire made such a loud noise, Tom suddenly awoke. He woke up all his family and got them out of there. He called out for the firemen and called out for the mayor and said, Let's knock these down or else they will catch fire too and it will spread through town. But no, the mayor would not do that. He said, Just hang about. The fire is not that bad, you know. We could soon put that out. So they tried to put the flames out, but they just grew higher. Sure enough, they spread. Soon half of London was on fire. King Charles, sitting in his palace, thought something must be done. He sent out a fire engine with a big water gun. They went to the Thames for water, but at the river bank, the fire engine slipped in mud, fell in the Thames and sank. When the king was told about this, he was really upset. He realised that the fire posed a very serious threat. He decided that he must help, put on his boots and cloak, and he marched out of that palace towards the fire and smoke. He helped some firefighters who had started to despair. And everyone was really glad that the good king was there. Eventually, the wind died down. The fire died down too. London would have to be rebuilt. There was much work to do. The damage caused would have been less in 1666 if the houses weren't made from wood, if they were made from bricks.